My name is Mrs. Clean. Each day, morning, and evening, I clean in front of my house. That is why they call me Mrs. Clean. One morning, like every morning, I was sweeping in front of my house. I swept away the many dead leaves the wind had blown there the night before. And what did I see under the leaves? A little white bean. And the little white bean was fast asleep. I pushed my broom hard up against the bean, and he slowly opened his eyes. Surprised to see him there in front of my door, I shouted, Who are you? What are you doing here? My name is Mr. Chillin, the bean replied. I was just sleeping here. Why do you wake me up? I said, go away from my doorstep or I will swallow you right now. Swallow me. If you swallow me, you'll be sorry because I will give you gas, replied Mr. Chillin. If you give me gas, I said, then I will poop you out just the way I do other things I swallow. A fight broke out, and soon we heard Tioki. Then we heard Fo, Fo, Go, Yo, and then Fi, Yo, Yi. Now look, Mr. Chillin said. Oh goodness, what is that? I asked. I was surprised to see a big multicolored worm emerge from my poop. In my most serious voice, I asked the worm, Who are you? And the worm answered, I am Miss Worm. And Mr. Chillin said to me, What did I tell you? Look what you did here. Then I said to Miss Worm, What are you doing here? And Miss Worm replied, Nothing. Why are you so angry? I said, I'm not angry at you. I wanted to get back at Mr. Chillin. Why did you want to get back at Mr. Chillin? asked Miss Worm. Because he slept in front of my door and made it dirty, I replied. Mr. Chillin and I started to fight with each other until Miss Worm came and separated us. Will the two of you please just stop fighting? You stay out of it, I said. Don't forget, I could swallow you too. What have I done to you? asked Miss Worm. Mind your own business. Stay out of this. Leave me in peace, I shouted arrogantly to Miss Worm. Miss Worm answered, Yes, peace. Peace. Me too, I want peace. We all want peace. Let's go together to the Daguna to make peace. Peace is a useful thing for all of us. Miss Worm kept talking. Are you two ever going to stop fighting? Being mad at each other is a part of life. But we need to find peace. Miss Worm moved closer to us and said, Well, Mrs. Clean and Mr. Chillin, you are both upset. And we must imagine another way of life. Well, what would that be? Mr. Chillin and I both asked. 